All right, guys, welcome. Uh, it's been a while. So uh, we are currently waiting for Nazulo Mesher. It's supposed to come down any time now. Uh, we're going to go to a shooting range where we shoot airsoft guns together with the Sat tree. We're going to pick up him later. So we're going to travel all the way to Yishun to get our real life apex, like shooting range. It's going to be exciting. We have our masks. We're going to practice safe distancing. So it's going to be very, very interesting. So. See you guys later. So what? Uh, hi, Terry. Hi, Terry. Oh, you have to check in? No gas. So basically, normal gun they run on the, the explosive yeah. that's in the bullet itself. For this case, it's actually running on gas that's compressed gas that's within the magazine. So actually, once you pick out the magazine, it's going to fire. Okay, okay. okay can. Uh, that should be good. Here we go. Yeah. Mm. Right. Every round counts. <laughs> you have approximately 240 rounds. Now. As far as you can, and you put it at the, yeah, at the end, near the bottom, yeah, nearer to the bottom, and you push it. So, for my recommendation is, ah, sorry. For my, my recommendation is uh, put it at like a slight 45 degree angle. Then oh, you okay. Press it. Oh. Then you will, it will load in on its own. Okay. So, if you find that this is jammed, right, mm. just give it a shake. Then you will, you should unjam and then continue. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Approximately one. Magazine can carry how much? Depends. Uh, Depends. Uh, like the Glock's a smaller magazine, so it takes about 19 or 20. Yeah. Uh, that one should take 20 something. But not this one. Not this one. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, 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 yeah. A bit more. Well, this is a bit yeah. heavy, eh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah this, this is, this is very close to the real steel one. Yeah. This one is full metal, this one is a plastic. Mm. If you feel, you can feel only the slight is metal, the rest are mostly plastic. Yeah. That's why they sound a bit more stable. Yeah. Mm, yes, if you talk about stability to shoot, yes, that one is more stable. No sure. Yeah. Then you try mine. Okay. okay, whenever you get ready. Alright. You want to shoot the right side? You want, you want to use glove or you want to use. I use the glove. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm going to 
truck. <laughs> yeah. Setting up. Shooter ready? Stand by. So what it does is um it holds around. It tries, it's supposed to hold around in place, uh. but there's a bar above, which is called the hop up. Uh. So the hop up bar is this uh, nut slash bar in the chamber above. Uh. So when you adjust it, it moves down. The bar uh. moves like this is the like this is the round right. So the bar moves down to put pressure on the BB. Okay. So what this does is that it gives it back spin to oh. counter uh, air resistance, so that it can fly further mm. instead of spinning the conventional way. Uh, Forward and then you just drop. So it backspins using uh, physics, uh, so your backspin can actually fly up or at least fly straight. Mm. So the issue with yours is probably that uh, the bar is either not far down enough or it could be that the hop up button is too oily. Oh. So it slips out. Stand by! Put it to him. <laughs> okay, yeah. Shooter ready? Stand by. Better than the other one. <laughs> All right, shooter ready. And bye. Better? <laughs> Better.